Well, the median price of a San Diego home in 2005 was $517,500. Now it's dropped to $280,000. More than a quarter of all the local homes are now worth less than the amount that's owned, uh, owed on their mortgages. President Obama recently announced details from his $75 billion mortgage relief plan. But will that plan help us here in America's finest city? Eric Rice is president of the homeowner education firm Dyer Beach. Eric, good morning. Good, morning. good to see you. All right, so break it down in simplistic terms because people sometimes get confused by mortgages. Sure. What is the president's plan? Well, his plan number one is to make sure that homeowners who have a shot at long-term pay are staying in their home. And again, the, the key is long-term pay. So if they have the ability to pay for three consecutive years, banks are willing to modify their loan in order to fit the bill. The other thing is that he's looking towards uh, a refinancing plan, refinancing for less than what you owe. Now, the key is that that goes from anywhere between 80 and 105% of your home's value. In San Diego, as you just described, we have dropped from 500 plus down to 280, which means that there's way more people that are over 105% here than really anywhere else in the country. That plan is designed for the Midwest or Ohio or Pittsburgh or some of those areas there that haven't been as severely affected by the drops in real estate values. And all our swing states, coincidentally, as well. Coincidentally. So what, then, would you like to see happen? I'd like to see them adjust it, just like they did with um, a couple years ago. They actually raised the FHA limits for and the jumbo limits for, for lending, which really honestly didn't make all that big of a difference then. That would definitely make a difference now if they raised San Diego, L.A. County, all these different areas. If they took them from 105 up to, say, 150 or even, I mean, we had calls in on my radio show last night, and 245% upside down. Mm. If they could help those people, those are the ones that really, really need the help. But you know the criticism. We all saw Rick Santelli on CNBC yelling about how these people were irresponsible. Why should taxpayers who did the right thing have to bail out people who did the wrong thing? No, I agree with him. I, I do. I agree with him. But the fact of the matter is, we've already funded the project. We might as well make the project worthwhile. The money is already set to be released to every bank in certain timing. Some of it's already been released. Um, we might as well make it as efficient as possible and take care of those that, you know, the, in general, losing your property value isn't always your fault. It might be five or six or seven people around you have short sold or, or foreclosed on their home. That causes you to lose severe value. So that person may be on time, and his plan does say he wants it for responsible borrow borrowers. So if this plan isn't going to work, then what in San Diego is being done to try to get some relief? Is there anything being done? Well, definitely. We're running a program right now. It's called the Help Now program. It's designed to take clientele who want to get a loan modification, who are in credit card debt, whatever it may be. We're, we're, we're building a team of professionals for them so that they have expertise in every area, shaving all their expenses building a model with them that the bank can look at and go, okay, we're going to help you out because you get one chance. And over the next three years, they get paid $3,000 to do so, which so, is pretty incredible. Now, from, but on a national perspective, you're saying that this thing won't work. Do you think that there is the political will to actually make a plan work that would help San Diego? Unfortunately, with economics, normally will doesn't have a whole lot to do with it. When it comes to an issue, it will. Uh, it'll, it'll, the will will have the ability to drive it through. But with economics, it's pretty broken down into numbers. Uh, the execution of those numbers and making sure that they're given out properly at the right times will definitely make the difference with the stimulus plan. And so for people out there that are really concerned about their own situation, what should they do? Uh, a, they can give us a call at our office or they can go to direbeach.com. Uh, if they're really concerned about anything, obviously hit Google. Hit the stimulus plan. Get yourself educated on it. You can always you know, contact the studio and they can contact me. I can send them out a packet on the stimulus plan. It breaks down everything in bullet points. It's really easy to understand. All right, and well, thank you very much for bringing us your insight this morning. Obviously, there's some people that disagree and uh, aren't fans of the plan, but we appreciate uh, hearing your point of view. And for more information on all this, you can go to sandiego6.com.